Hi guys and thanks for joining us. My name is Joe Christie and I'm the Managing Director of Iron Skin Australia. I'm here today to talk about the latest developments in the Iron Skin Protective Dive Suit. For those of you that aren't familiar, Iron Skin Protective Dive Suit is aimed at commercial divers, spearfishermen and free divers. And the suit is designed to provide a greater degree of protection in the unlikely event of a shark attack. The suit is worn over your chosen wetsuit and you simply pull it on and it covers your arms, your abdomen, your chest, your back, legs, etc. This is just a sample sleeve that I'll be talking about in further detail and I want to pull apart some of the design features of the product. So you can see here that the Einskin Protective Dive Suit contains a strong flexible polymer material and it has platelets that are attached using a very strong mechanical device. The platelets are designed to have holes in them so that in the unlikely event of a shark attack, the shark teeth get caught in the holes and as the shark shakes its head from side to side, the platelets will follow the shark's teeth and that is aimed to prevent penetration of the shark's teeth through the suit. So this particular sleeve here contains the smaller platelets and they are used on the suit for parts of the body that require flexibility, such as the elbow, the shoulder, back of the knees and the front of the chest actually. We also have here another sleeve with our larger platelets. They follow similar principles to the smaller platelets. They have holes in them that will capture the shark teeth. The platelets will move as the shark shakes its head from side to side. The platelets are attached using a very strong mechanical device. These particular platelets, being the larger platelets, are approximately four times larger than the smaller platelets. One of the benefits of that is obviously greater protection, but also when the shark teeth hit the platelet, they spread the force of the bite over a greater area. These platelets typical, typically cover the abdomen, the bicep, the forearm, quadriceps, and the calf area. Now we've done some testing in the laboratory where we have shark teeth attached to a mechanical device and they're dropped with great force. In all instances, the shark teeth shatter when they hit the platelets. What we're going to be doing shortly is some field testing where we'll be filling these particular plastic bags with chum, so fish carcasses. We'll be placing the bags inside the, these two protective sleeves and we'll be taking footage of sharks biting upon the sleeves and then we'll provide feedback on the impact that the bites have had on these plastic bags. So that's all for now. My name's Joe Christie from Ironskin Australia. Thanks again for joining us and stay tuned for more.